Steve, tell me that it won't last too long. It's not going to last all that long. It's certainly going to last throughout the evening and uh, even into about the first half of tomorrow. And then we'll be dry for your Sunday afternoon and Monday. If you have plans to head up to Troy, uh, if you waited all day to leave until now, it's not going to be all that great out there tonight. Soggy berries there at the Troy uh, Strawberry Festival. Cloudy and rainy this evening. 100% chance of rain with temperatures falling from the 70s into the 60s this evening and that after a high today in the lower 80s and then tomorrow on Sunday if you hold off until about 10 11 o'clock in the morning I think you'll have a very good afternoon there at the Strawberry Festival a few showers uh, scattered about there on your Sunday morning I mentioned the fact that our high reached the lower 80s before the rain 82 degrees at Dayton International that after a cool morning low of 53 and we've had just a little bit of rainfall and that is starting to add up there at the uh, International Airport but not uh, recorded just yet on our almanac. Live Doppler 2 HD and you can see the rain is fairly widespread across the Miami Valley, certainly across the north. We're seeing some moderate rain over southern Mercer County, uh, southern Auglaize, even uh, parts there of Shelby County and over into northern dark, some uh, pockets of moderate rain. Otherwise, when you get along and south of I-70, it is lighter and it is more scattered at the moment, but we'll definitely uh, see that widespread rain as we head throughout the evening. If you look at the satellite radar composite, you can see that rain uh, over Indiana, some showers, even some thunderstorms there over uh, southern Illinois, just out ahead of that area of low pressure. This is what will probably move through as we head through early tomorrow morning on your Sunday. Rainfall forecast, not a lot of rain when you add it all up. Uh, I think we'll see anywhere between a quarter to maybe a half inch. There could be a little area that picks up just slightly more than a half inch, but that should be about it. Here's the camera. Uh, cloudy skies there in the Beaver Creek area from our Jeff Schmidt Auto Group camera. Look at that. The temperature from 82 degrees to 69 and a breeze out of the west and southwest at 17 there at Dayton International. And you can see where the rain has been falling for a bit. That cool off into the 60s. 63 in Richmond, 66 Union City. You can see 65 in Eaton and 67 at Oxford. Other areas uh, holding on into the 70s, at least for a short while longer. Here's future track that uh, rain continuing to move through as we head through the evening hours. There's 9 o'clock. Here's 11 o'clock this evening. Uh, rain even uh, into tomorrow morning, at least scattered about on your Sunday morning. And then as we head into the afternoon, we should see that the cloud cover move out and even a little bit of sunshine for the second half of your Sunday. Tonight, periods of rain could see an isolated thunderstorm will drop down to 62 degrees. And then tomorrow, 77 will be the high on your Sunday with scattered showers in the morning and then that sun by mid to late afternoon. And the seven day forecast, the work week, uh, Kajaja talked about that. Monday, it's going to be dry. It's going to be warm, 85 degrees, but more chances of rain on Tuesday, and they really ramp up those rain chances as we head into Wednesday.